Hey, are you ready for this? The bids for United taking new levels. Saudi Arabia has ruled out a state-backed takeover of Manchester United due to their investment in Newcastle. Hello Red fan, if you are truly engaged with the Reds and you don't want to never miss out on any update from Manchester United landing here, subscribe now to the channel because I'll always be bringing you the latest news for you firsthand. Newcastle was subject to a Saudi finance consortium takeover last year with the country's sovereign wealth fund, public investment fund, PIF, purchasing an 80% stake to become majority shareholders at St. James Park. PIF is said to be worth 320 billion pounds, which makes them roughly 13 times richer than Manchester City's owners, but they would be unable to buy United from the Glazers because they already control a majority stake in Newcastle. Newcastle's takeover has also faced immense scrutiny and accusations of sports washing due to Saudi Arabia's human rights record, which has led to calls for the Premier League to change their owners and directors test. Saudi Arabia sports minister Prince Abdulaziz bin Turki Al Faisal told The Times this week, the PIF just invested in Newcastle and I think we are focusing as a PIF on that. If a private investor wants to come in, why not? I think it is a good opportunity and if the numbers add up and we can all benefit from that from a business perspective, why not? If there is an opportunity that benefits us, I would encourage the private sector to do so. Although PIF is invested in Newcastle, that would not prevent investment from the private sector in the kingdom. Sheffield United was owned by Abdullah bin Mursed Al Saad, who founded a paper manufacturing company in 1989 before the Newcastle takeover and bought 50% of the club in 2013 before assuming full control in 2019. So guys, do you think these intents of acquisition from Saudi Arabia could lead to a good deal for Man United or not? Leave your valuable opinion in the comments below.